Well, now to continuing coverage. The search continues for the missing Stag High School student in Stockton. It's now been four days since the student allegedly jumped into the Calaveras River. ABC 10's Gabriel Porras joins us now live in studio. So, Gabriel, you've been covering this story for days now. What have you learned so far? Well, Jordan, like you said, officials are not giving up on finding the 15 year old this morning. A search wrapped up around 5 p.m. last night across the street from the high school. District officials say four people got into a fight Wednesday on campus. And when administrators tried to break up that fight, two of the teens allegedly ran to the river and jumped in. Only one of those teens resurfaced. Crowds of people have been on the levee to support the family throughout the search. I spoke with the missing student's mother yesterday. She says the community has been stepping up for her family. The community's been out here. I had a friend that was on her kayak yesterday because of the search team called it off early. So we had a lot of community out here, a lot of students. And despite it having been days now since the disappearance, she says she is hopeful. We just hope if he is in there, he's recovered. If not, we hope somebody gets a phone call in the family saying we spoke to him and we can all just reunite and give him a big old hug. Now, a vigil was held on the levee last night, and the Stockton Unified School District confirmed that a search will continue today. So, Gabe, we know some people were asking about the possibility of draining the river to help with that search. That's right. I reached out to the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers who told me that the New Hogan Dam feeds the Calaveras River. They say they did not receive a request to drain the river to help with the search, but coincidentally, they were already planning to decrease flows and are now moving forward with that plan which could possibly help to find that student. According to the agency, it was the low tides yesterday that made a searcher stop that search before sunset. All right, well, Gabriel Porras, thank you for that update.